The Newport Art Museum is a splendid institution that has been serving its members, our visitors to the state, and the residents of our state for over a hundred years. Here you can enjoy a variety of events and programs, exhibitions that tell the story of Rhode Island artists. You can meet people of like mind and share ideas around art, all in the setting of these incredibly wonderful historic buildings. I get asked quite often, how do you choose the art? How do you select the artists for a certain show? I've spent a lot of the last uh, several years uh, journeying around Rhode Island and sometimes around other states, doing what is called studio visits, meeting with artists who have work that has a Rhode Island connection, um, artists who want me to look at their progress. It's very important to me that we have a balanced exhibition schedule, that we have a range of artists in terms of media, in terms of ethnicities, in terms of ages, group shows, solo shows, so that we can attract new audiences, but also so we are meeting our mission in terms of making art and uh, artistic opportunities available to as wide a range of audience as possible. Part of our mission uh, involves actually art making, and we like to um, collaborate with our Coleman Center, the school, in terms of some of the artists in group exhibitions doing a workshop or teaching a class in the school. Here at the Coleman Center for Creative Studies, we offer a wide variety of classes. We have a great state-of-the-art digital studio. We have a fantastic ceramics program, as well as a printmaking studio and open studios for life drawing, as well as painting classes. We offer classes to students from the age of six and up. So even if you're 80, you could come down and take a class with us. We'd really enjoy that. The reason why I think being able to teach is a blessing is because it means that I can help people to do something they have always wanted to do and thought they could not do. I try to make everyone realize that they have something to give and uh, what they have to do is to learn to appreciate themselves. I'm very, very happy to be here and I'm happy that they put up with me. <laughs> that shows that they are extremely kind, and I love them dearly. There are a number of ways that you can be involved with this museum to support it, and all of which are fun. Volunteering, first and foremost, is such a critical activity and something that our museum staff enjoys. But things like the gala, wet paint, and some of the exhibits, these don't happen on their own. They require a great deal of work. And what a wonderful thing to be working alongside artists and hanging this work. But there's also the financial opportunities to work with the museum. And your gift is important, whether it's a small gift or a large gift. Uh, just realize that the majority of the funding for this museum comes from donors just like you.